Hey guys, sorry about that last part. Yeah, I ran out of space. I hope that never happens again. But basically what I guess you did miss seeing was I got the Cheeto page from In the Fish, which you did see a little bit of. And then there, there was a Torpedo Kazooie switch here. That uh, Torpedo Kazooie area that you could blow up. And, uh, yeah, we, I basically got rid of that, and then I realized I wasn't recording. But as you may have noticed, this, uh, pipe, I think it looks different than the one to Glitter Gulch Mine. And the reason for that is it goes to a different area. And that is the basement of the waste disposal plant. Which is in World 6. Grunty Industries. Yeah, you'd be able to see this Jinjo from inside a room where you get a move. Uh, which is a very helpful move. But as you can notice, uh, our air is back. And that's because we're not in Jolly Roger's Lagoon. Which is where we had the... Uh, the water oxygenated, which I don't think is possible in real life, so I wouldn't recommend trying to do that. Because if you did, you'd probably kill yourself, I don't know, like from being underwater too long. I'm not exactly sure. But um, the moral of the story is don't try to oxygenate water unless you are mumbo jumbo with mumbo jumbo who would have guessed but yes that's all we needed to do in this world or the only thing that we can do at this point and i actually want to see that jinjo did not count for this world that's not good i'm missing a jinjo somewhere that's that's not good um, yeah, I'll find it eventually, when we come back. Yeah, I'll do it then, that's a, that's an idea. Um, but yeah, aside from Wishy World, apparently there are like, there are some Jiggies that I'm missing in there that I don't know which ones I missed. So I'll have to go around and look for the Jiggies that I know I got and see which ones I missed. And then, uh, in Glitter Gorge Mine, apparently, you were able to get more Jiggies in there. So, uh, yeah, we could have unlocked Grunty Industries, which is World 6, then. But, um, yeah, we have 34 Jiggies now. I want to say that's enough to, uh, to unlock... The next world, which is world six, but um, we're not gonna do that exactly right now because you know that I think that would be a waste of time. I mean, it technically wouldn't, but we would be able to, uh, we'll be able to get some more story stuff done in this episode, like, like this in here in Pine Grove. There is a part of the digger trail, and I am not very good, and I can't believe that counted. But yes, there's a Kazooie rock here that we have to, to destroy, and once you do that, we go inside, and we are in another digger tunnel, and if anything happens like the way it happened before, that music is making me think that we might fight Klungo again. Oh man. The revenge seeking minions time. Oh no, not you again. <laughs> I'm sad, Klungo. I slap you or I give more beatings. We'll give you a beating too. No, Klungo, win this time. There's no potion to try. Dude, I need to, like, turn the game up. That's a bit better. So, 
sorry for that, but sorry. No, not the invisibility one. I hate this one. Yeah, but now he's invisible. And I can't tell exactly where he is. I think I'm chasing him. Like, you can... Oh, he was over there. Yeah, see, I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, you can hit him with eggs. I didn't know that. That makes this a bit easier. Then running into him. Dude, I didn't run into the shield. I hit Klungo again. Yeah, for the, for the invisibility fight, I am going to be using eggs. Because I cannot find Klungo when he disappears. Klungo, where are you? Is he behind me? Oh, dude! I was right there! He spawned the shield like the second I was about to hit him. Now he's dead. We beat him. Aaron Bird Beast for Klungo again. It can't be good for your health, Klungo. Who want to retire? No, Mr. Sneeze me. Klungo returned from what beatings. Now he sounds English. Then work on new coaching. Okay, guys, I do know that, um, that, there we go. That, uh, this is a, this might be a bit of a short video. Because even though this is technically a new video, I want to act like this is the other half of the last part that, uh, that didn't, that got cut off. So what we're going to do now is just get, grab this new move and then we'll end the episode off. Still to melt egg for you to hold the clockwork bomb that's remote controlled. That was it? Dude, that was all? Yeah, you can only hold ten of these. That'll be all. Dismissed. Okay, dude, he didn't do it three times in a row. But yes, as you can see here, you, you may not be able to tell, but you can only get one clockwork egg from every uh, nest. Which is crazy. Or actually, I guess I will grab these. Which are not only the last of our notes, but there's a Jinjo over here. Yeah, the Jinjo on the left is the big one. And it's another black Jinjo. And you may not know it, but we're only missing ten notes in the Isle of Hags. And they are over here. And I thought my video stopped for a second. I would have been kind of pissed off if that happened. But you do want to remember this area for later. Because the music changed, and you see a thing over there, and the environment changed as well. Uh, not sure why I only have 480 notes. Uh, did I never grab the treble clef? Oh, yeah, 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 crap, never mind, guys. Uh, geez, I'm sorry. I thought we had gotten the uh, 20 notes from around, uh, the seventh world, gracious. Jeez, man. But yeah, that is this, that, uh, world, what? No, okay, this is like the random stop honeycomb, except it, if, if except it's not entirely random, because... You, you can do some skill to get your life up, or you can screw yourself over really easily. But yes, next time on Banjo, on more Let's Play Banjo Tui, we will start the next world, World 5. Pterodactyl Land. See you then. Au revoir.